What's good peepers, Alvin GK1 back with another video. As I said before in my previous video, trying to be more consistent with it. So introducing to you the Precision Goalkeeping Smycology 5 Goalkeeper Gloves. Now, you might recognize these gloves and recognize the um, print on the personalization on the wrist strap. Uh, these are actually the model worn by none other than Casper Smeichel when he was with Precision Goalkeeping. These were actually the gloves he wore when he lifted the Premier League trophy. And to prove it, if you wait to the end, I've got a picture to show you. Now looking at the glove bag, usual stuff on there, about sizing, barcodes, and a little description of the glove, and also the glove name, Smycology 5. Um, nice glove bag actually, when you think about it, two different compartments to put your gloves in, so when used, or when wet, you're not putting them palm to palm, or backhand to backhand, when they're drying, or just in general storage. Um, you'll notice from the gloves, I only have one plastic um, clear bag on one of the gloves, and because one only has it and the other doesn't, there's a slight little bit of yellowing. Um, that's just due to age and really and truly because I've had these gloves since 2016. And um, yeah, age catches up with everyone. What I actually like about these gloves, as you can see, nice full latex wrist strap with a personalization area. Um, personalized with uh, Smyrk, obviously, because these are his gloves. Not his exact gloves, but these were his gloves. I um, actually like the wrist strap, and as you see, it's got a weird material in the gussets. Is it a PVC or vinyl type of gussets? Um, nice color, red, definitely not letting any air flow through. And as you can see, it's a wind block material on the, um, the body of the glove. So all the white material, that's the wind block material. As you can see from the latex, you see loads of little dots all over the latex. That's actually the graphite material. It's actually a graphite latex. So it's meant to add durability and um, grip to the latex, so it should last longer. Um, haven't used this latex personally, but I haven't spoken to um, relevant keepers who've used the uh, same gloves or used the latex in the past. It's actually meant to be very good in the wet. Um, just looking at the glove, looking at the labels, standard si stuff in the labels, size 11 and the brand name really, nothing else really there. <clears throat> Putting the gloves on with the um, wrist entry, nice textile wrist entry, so easy to get into. But as you can see from the wrist strap, a bit of um, discoloration from just generally from the age of the glove. Like, like I said, from 2016 and not being in a plastic bag, this is what happens unfortunately. And with the wrist closure, it's got two Velcro parts on the glove. So one just on the inside of the palm and the general main one on the wrist area on the outside of the palm. Uh, I do generally prefer three, but um, two, still a good secure fit. And um, the glove strap's not coming off anytime. But one caution to notice, if you've got very thick wrists, um, this wrist strap is not going to suit you, it's going to come up short because for me I've got skinny wrists and it comes up just literally perfect so there's no overhand or anything like that. Backhand, two piece super soft backhand, just plain simple, nothing over fancy, just covering majority of the backhand but with the split to actually allow flexibility. Um, Kasper Smeichel himself with his personal SMU of the glove it was slightly different with the backhand especially. His one was a whole one piece backhand, so no split whatsoever. And yeah, the retail was slightly different because um, I don't know why, to tell the truth, but um, that's how it come up. Um, without a pre-wash, as you can see with the gloves, still a very good grip on the ball. It's not going anywhere, not slipping out of my hands or anything like that. So I can only imagine what the gloves would be like with a good solid pre-wash but if you're looking forward to seeing more videos from me make sure you like share subscribe because i will try to be more consistent and comment below let me know what you thought of leicester winning the title back in 2016 and also what you thought of the gloves cassif michael was wearing at the time 
got loads more retro, new and old school gloves to basically showcase to you all. And hopefully you'll enjoy. And don't forget, tell a friend to tell a friend. Alvin GK1 out.